हेलो स्टूडेंट्स अल्फा गामा यूट्यूब चैनल पर मैं आपका स्वागत करता हूं मैं आपके सामने बीएससी जो फर्स्ट ईयर सेकंड सेमेस्टर का प्रैक्टिकल लेके आया हूं कि हाउ टू फाइंड हाई रेजिस्टेंस बाय सब्सटीट्यूशन मेथड इसमें इसके लिए हम कांस्टेंट करंट और कांस्टेंट वोल्टेज का यूज़ करेंगे सबसे पहले गैलोमीटर का रजिस्टेंस फाइंड आउट करेंगे और उसके बाद हमारा हाई रजिस्टेंस बाय सब्सटीट्यूशन मैथड फाइंड होगा तो हाउ टू फाइंड हाई रजिस्टेंस फर्स्ट स्टेप है रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ गैलोमीटर टू मेजर रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ गैलोनोमीटर तो वी हैव अ कॉन्स्टेंट सोर्स ऑफ वोल्टेज वी कनेक्टेड विद ए हाई रेजिस्टेंस नॉन रेजिस्टेंस कनेक्टेड विथ विथ हाई रेजिस्टेंस आर कैलोमीटर देन इट्स इट्स ऑज ए डिफ्लेक्शन यानी कॉन्स्टेंट करंट हेयर फोर द कॉन्स्टेंट वोल्टेज से डिफ्लेक्शन इज थीटा डिफ्लेक्शन सोन बाई द गैलोमीटर इज थीटा तो यूजिंग ओमसला देर विल बी आई विल बी द करंट डिवेलप इन दिस सर्किट तो यूजिंग ओमसला टोटल इफेक्टिव रेजिस्टेंस सी इज द रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ गैलोमीटर देन टोटल इफेक्टिव रेजिस्टेंस इन द सर्किट सीरीज इज आर प्लस जी into i will be the current is equal to constant voltage to find the measurement of g we have to find the resistance of galvanometer we connect a sun resistance as parallel to this galvanometer g such that the current in the galvanometer is half that 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 is half deflection तो करंट इन दिस सर्किट इज हम बाई टू बट दिस करंट इज चेंज टू वैल्यू आई वन नाउ करंट इन सेंट रेजिस्टेंस विल बी आई वन माइनस आई बाय टू तो यू एंड द इफेक्टिव रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ दिस कम्बिनेशन विल बी जी एंड एस आर इन पैरल दैट विल बी जी इंटू एस बाय जी प्लस एस और प्लस आर इन इज सीरीज टोटल करंट इज आई वन नाउ एंड The voltage is constant. We also voltage in parallel will be same. G into I by two it will be equal to I one minus I by two into S will equal. So first of all, using these equations, R plus C into I will be equal to G S by G plus S plus R into I one. Now first of all find I from here. So it G into S by two is equal to I one into S minus C I by two. From here left side me right me write here. G I by two plus S I by two will be equal to I one S. So G L by two is common. That is G plus S is equal to I one into S. From here I will be two times of S by G plus S or into I. Putting this value of I from here in this equation, then R plus G into two S by G plus S. Into I one will equal to G S by G plus S plus R into क्या हो जाएगा I one I one से I one cancel throughout multiply करेंगे G plus S से ये हो जाएगा two R S plus two G S is equal to G S plus R G plus R S R G plus R S So from here one G S will be cancelled out, one R S will be also cancelled out. From here R S plus G S will be equal to R G 
of Rg minus Gs is equal to Rs. G common zero, R minus S is equal to R S. Now G is equal to R into S by R minus S. So knowing the this is unknown resistance, high resistance of the area of curve, or is ke comparatively ye S resistance, hundred resistance hoga jo parallel me use karenge, aur ye hota hai low as compared to this. So jo apko jo circuit milega hai diagram. वो ये रेजिस्टेंस बॉक्स में जाएंगे दो तरह के मिलेंगे एक हाई रेजिस्टेंस और एक आपका थोड़ा सा उसके कंपैरेटिवली लो तो और रेजिस्टेंस जो होंगे वो हाई नॉन रेजिस्टेंस लेंगे और सेंट रेजिस्टेंस जो यूज करोगे वो लो वैल्यू के कंपैरेटिव टू दिस और दूसरे रेजिस्टेंस बॉक्स से एस वैल्यूज लोगे इसकी कॉम्बिनेशन से आपको हाफ डिफ्लेक्शन से आप रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ गैलोमीटर फाइंड कर सकते हैं for the combination where R gives the deflection in galvanometer I and there we use a S resistance in parallel to galvanometer for that galvanometer shows half deflection so by using this formula we can calculate the resistance of galvanometer so this is the first step of your experiment now uh, we find karna hai unknown resistance of I value so is ke liye, so first of all we G ki value pata honi thi G thi so G will be R into S by R minus S. Second part is our main experiment. Our main experiment is. In that, we have resistance of high value, unknown value of resistance. We have to find it. So, second part to find unknown resistance of high value. That is X. For that, connect a voltage V. with the unknown resistance of high value x and galvanometer shows a deflection such man that that is theta deflection shows by galvanometer any constant current i will be shown by the galvanometer g so for that using ohm's law x and g resistance are in series so similarly v is equal to using ohm's law x plus g into i that is first equation also we use a if now replace this resistance by unknown resistance r and high value resistance known resistance r and sun resistance with comparatively low value that of r in parallel to g that is s value or these resistance are in such a way that this galvanometer shows the same deflection as shown in case of a unknown resistance so for that g and s are in parallel so effective resistance Gs by G plus S or plus R will be in series into I dash is the current now I1 is equal to also V equation number 2 also that these are in parallel so if the voltage drop across these two ends A and B will be same and I will be the current zone galvanometer now G I is equal to S into I1 minus I1 minus I. Now G I is equal to S I1 minus S I. So is koida layam S I ko G I plus S I will be S I1. So I common loge. So G plus S into I is equal to S I1. From here I will be S by G plus S of I1. Using this value in this equation, in using these two compare x plus g into i is equal to g s by g plus s plus r into i1. Using value of i from here, x plus g into i1 is s by g plus s of i1 is equal to g s by g plus s plus r into i1. Multi uh, multiplying through throughout by g plus s i1 will cancel out throughout to x plus g into s is equal to g s by plus g r plus r s now x s plus g s g s plus g r plus r s 
GS can cancel out fault and for the value of x x s is equal to g r comma you know, g plus s or x will be r g plus s into r by s so this will be the value of unknown resistance so using the combination we have g by the first experimental setup s and r from these combinations uh, putting the value of g s and r we can find unknown resistance thanks for watching